morning. So, one more week till Christmas. Y'all excited? Mm hmm. You girls all better? Yep. <laughs> well, I have a couple passages here. I was going to wrap one really, really ugly, but. And these aren't wrapped very good, but. Um, this one is wrapped a little prettier, isn't it? Got a nice clean bow on it. I'm Somebody want to open that one for me? Um, you will? Okay, open that present up and see what we got. See what's inside. <laughs> paper. Nothing's in there, right? Not really. I just stuck that paper in there because I need some more jelly. So there's nothing in there. Hmm. Well, you guys, you know, are getting ready to do a Christmas program, and there's a song in there. McKinley said this was her favorite song of it, and I, I kind of think so too. But there's, um, there's a verse in there, and it says, "It's like a present." Well, I'll just, I'll just read all of it. The first verse says, "A life-size Santa, frosted window panes, a snowy driveway lined with candy canes." It's kind of funny. It's kind of fake. If it's only glitz and tinsel, it's a meaningless display. It's like a present with no gift inside. It's like a Christmas card that no one cared to sign. I'm sure I've done it from time to time. I've polished up the surface and not what's deep inside. When you guys are singing that, what, what, what does all that mean? It's like a present with no gift inside. There's nothing. So, um, who, did, who can who can that? What is this song saying? What did you all just do? We'll give away a little bit of the program. Where have you all just been when you sing this song? Which house have you been to? You remember? I think it's the first one. I think you've been to where the house is just decorated to the hilt. But what does the two, what do the two people inside, do they understand, what do they want to try to give you? Money. Money. And they're like, just get off of our decorations on the lawn, because you're messing up our decorations. So, when this song says it's like a present with no gift inside, can we be like that sometimes? Sometimes we look really pretty on the outside. Get all decked out, and it's okay that it doesn't necessarily mean dress, but we get we put on our really good self, we put on our nice <coughs> behavior, and we put on our manners, and we put on which is good, and we put on our big smiles, and we put on okay, but what's inside? Sometimes paper, paper. yeah, there might be paper. But what, what does, and, and like a Christmas card, if you get a Christmas card and it's not signed, well, that's not good, is it? That means the person didn't care enough to sign it. You've polished up the surface and not what's deep inside. What does God see? What does God see? Does he look at the outside? What does he see? Doesn't God look at what's inside? Doesn't God want you to be, um, doesn't he want you to have a good heart? Doesn't he want you to be kind, all the fruits of the Spirit? Doesn't he want you to have kindness and goodness? And, 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 and maybe, maybe sometimes the outside, you know, might not look, you know, maybe, I mean, I go out, I go out sometimes, I don't look so good, you know. But if, um, if I'm out and I see somebody in need or if somebody needs help and I help them, God doesn't really care what I look like out here. He cares about what I've done and what I look like on the inside. So um, the next verse in this song says, Lord, this is my Christmas prayer. Fill me with love for people, people everywhere. In all I say, in all I do, when, I, when they look at me, I want them to see you. Okay? So, um, that's all I have this morning.
Okay, it's not always about the pretty package um, on the outside, but it's what's inside that counts. Okay, same way with with um, I was like I was going to do with presents. Sometimes the ugliest present might have the best gift inside, right? Sometimes could be. So don't necessarily. Sometimes I'm guilty of that. If we go to a party that has a whole bunch of presents out there, I'll look for the package that like that package looks really good. And then sometimes when you open it, I'm like, well, that's not what I thought was in there. <laughs> and so you kind of, um, yeah, it's like, don't just look at the package. You want to see what's inside. Right, Brinley? All right, so somebody can open this package. We'll pray, and then somebody can open this package, and it might have a little bit of something else in it. We'll see. So let's pray. <laughs> Dear Heavenly Father, help us to remember that it's not what's on the outside, but what's on the inside. Help us to um, um, to be you in this world. Help us that when people see us, they see you, and um, they see what's inside more than what's on the outside. Um, we just lift this prayer up to you at Christmas, and we pray um, as, as this week moves on and things get busy that you help us to remember that, Lord, and help us to always be kind and... and um, Help us to be you out in the world, Father. Um, I just lift this prayer up to you in your holy and precious name and all God's children said, Amen. Okay. Who wants to open that? It's actually easier. Just pull the lid off. Oh, there is something in there. <laughs> there is something. More than just paper. <laughs> <laughs>